aircraft. Sounds like he's got it running. This runs a 100cc gas motor. He'll be putting on a full 3D aerobatic. If you look at the deflection on the elevator and the ailerons on this aircraft, it's almost straight up and down. He says on his sheet he's been flying for five years. He started at age 13. Claims to be a high school graduate class of 2010. Aircraft weighs about 27 pounds. Harvey's been flying freestyle and precision aerobatics for about three and a half years. Knife edge into a full snap. Another snap to knife edge. Class of airplanes get to stay 3D. They're able, to, they're able to actually hang the airplane on the propeller. Low, slow, rolling circle. This is requiring every surface. His hands are very, very busy at the moment. The older experienced pilots refer to it as stirring paint. That's what your hands look like on the radio when you're performing those maneuvers. Into a high alpha nose in hover, just, just touching the tail wheel. We have Ron Johnson. Please come and see the pit boss right away. Ron Johnson. Covering torque roll down the runway. Into a knife edge pass. Again, due to the power to weight ratio of these model aircraft, you wouldn't see a real aircraft hanging on a propeller that low to the ground. There's another low knife edge pass down the runway. No guts, no glory. Very climbing spin. Back into an elevator. Gonna do an inverted pass, maybe drag the tail in the grass. How low can you go? Whoa, there's the tail. Oh, and we've lost a rudder. So here we go. A little bit of a forced landing. Should be able to bring it down in one piece. Emergency landing. Oh, that was a little tough. When you lose a surface like that, it requires everything in your power. Let's have a big hand for Harvey. The name of the game is to bring it down safely, so he's done that. A little too low, just a little. Hot dogging. Shot a CA and he's all good, ready to go. Little biggie. 